Hi Burners, I'm here with the lovely Kara. You may have noticed her on a lot of our stories on Instagram. <laughs> What would you say that you do here? I do a lot of stuff with the advertising, the digital sphere, and I do little design. I do a bunch of web stuff, so I do a lot of the website stuff. Um, She's the genius level here that does stuff that I don't even know how to do or exist, but is highly necessary. And she's called me in today and I have no idea what we're doing. So I'm just gonna handball it over to Kara and we'll figure out what we're doing from here. Well, here's the thing. Part of my job is knowing what people are doing, um, asking about online, right? They have so many questions and I don't know how to answer them because I have some knowledge but you, you're the genius when it comes to supplements. You're the Red Hat CEO and you have so much scientific backing and your knowledge that I just can't answer these questions. So I've decided that I want to ask you every couple of weeks some of the most asked questions in Australia pertaining to supplements, pertaining to the products we sell, pertaining to the industry. And so that is what I'm here to do today. Awesome live. Put me on the spot. Let's do it. All right. Which supplements should I take for the gym? Okay. So always number one is if you're hitting the gym, you're going to be putting the body through some stress. It's going to need to recover. We need to give it the bricks to recover. So protein. Protein is, I would say, always number one. Um, for guys, we understand it, but females might have a common misconception that they're gonna take protein and just gonna end up with huge amounts of muscle. Protein's actually more important to females than it is to males, and what they'll notice is a great recovery, maybe some good muscle tone, but because they don't have as much testosterone or are doing very, very heavy, heavy, heavy weights, they're not gonna grow, they're just gonna look great. So, Protein would be number one. Give the body the building blocks for recovery. So many people have, were also asking, when should they take their protein? So if muscle recovery and gain is the goal, straight away after the training session. Okay. So I ideally don't recommend before or during unless you've got a crazy digestive system that absorbs amino acids super fast because what a lot happens to a lot of people is all the blood will rush to their stomach to digest protein. If you have it before or during, there's no blood left for your muscles while you're training and you need blood for your muscles. So you go into what's called a blood conflict where you don't absorb the uh, protein properly. You also don't train hard as hard as you could because all the blood's in the stomach for digestion. So if you want muscle gain, have it directly afterwards. If you want more fat loss from your session, have it half an hour afterwards. Okay. So muscle gain straight away, fat loss half an hour afterwards. The body can burn some good amount of body fat after a good training session for half an hour, and then it kind of switches to burning away um, amino acids from your muscle. So yeah, that's that's when well, I was. That's say. really good. Yeah. So people are asking about pre-workout. Like, do they need to take pre-workout? You don't need to take pre-workout if you're going to the gym, you're smashing out your sessions without it and you think, oh, it's great. But if you're tired, maybe you haven't had a great sleep, maybe you've got more time and this workout's gonna be huge and you want it to be a massive, massive training session, pre-workout is hugely scientifically helpful because pre-workouts can open up blood vessels, more glucose delivery, nutrient delivery, um, oxygen delivery and waste removal because you've got bigger pipes in the body. You're stripping lactic acid, you're hitting the adrenals with the caffeine and your central nervous system is activating, you're getting a lot stronger and more energy. So pre-workouts, amazing if you want a big session. Awesome. But if you don't need it, you don't need it. So um, it's all, again, what you said, it's about where they're at and what they want to do. Okay. Yeah, all right. So those have been three questions and I'll be back in a couple weeks with more. I hope that wasn't too much, Bernice. I appreciate it. Thanks, Kai. He's so he knows so much things. Uh, so look, look at me in words, and then you hear him. I'm sick of my own voice now.